Yo guys! So the Android Oreo update has been released, and it has a lot of cool features in it. However, there are a couple major bugs and a few annoyances that we should talk about. So the first major bug that I found was with picture and picture video. So it's an awesome feature and everything, but if you're watching a picture and picture video for within a YouTube app for example, and you go to your home screen, and then you turn off your device, and let's say you try to turn it back on using a fingerprint scanner, well, your device crashes and reboots. And I'm pretty sure this is not supposed to happen. And I was able to replicate this multiple times, so this is not a one-time fluke, but hopefully they can update something either within the YouTube app or doing a system update that will fix this issue. So the second major issue is with adding shortcuts to your home screen. So I always like to keep a shortcut to a website on my home screen, but if I go within Chrome and try adding it to my home screen, it does not add for some reason. Now, this does work on a stock launcher, but on any third-party launcher, it's not going to add to the home screen. Now, this is a very minor bug compared to the picture-in-picture -picture video, but still, it's an annoyance. Now, this next one is not a bug, it's just a big personal annoyance of mine, and that's the new Android Oreo emojis. They just don't look as good as the original emojis. And also, some emojis have a completely different look than original Android emojis, which kind of convey a completely different emotion. And finally, that notification tray. I don't know why Google insists on not putting more black into the notification tray and instead doing an all white design, but it's just burning on your eyes. Now, despite these annoyances and bugs, Android O does have a lot of cool features, some of which include the new Bluetooth audio codecs. So if you have a high quality Bluetooth headset, well now you can use a high quality codec to match the compression for that headset. Another cool thing is Google Play Protect. Google is really cracking down on security in Android O, and they're taking a lot of steps to scan your apps and inform you if you have a malware app on your device. And finally, the one I'm most excited about is the Autofill API, so apps like LastPass can use this, and you don't have to rely on accessibility settings. So guys, overall, like I said, Android Oreo is a great update, just a couple of bugs and annoyances to be dealt with, but hopefully within a month, this will all be taken care of. So guys, if you liked this video, definitely give it a thumbs up, don't forget to go and follow me on social media, and as always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for another galvanizing video. Thanks.